Wow. What have you been out doing today, Grumpy? What have you been out doing? Catch anything fun? I'm going to go plant some cucumbers, Grumpy. Good afternoon for Bobblehead Homestead. I am Jeff. Today is Friday. It is 60, 62, sunny, uh, nice breeze. It is kind of windy today. Yesterday was, uh, took a day off, but it's nice to be down, you know, 62, because on Wednesday, the day I went over to Drew at Dutch Creek Cabin, it hit 92, 92 degrees. Today it's 62 degrees. Yep, uh, yesterday was a nice day, it was in the 70s, I, uh, I did a couple things, but I, I'm, I need to take it easy for, <laughs> for a few days, let my muscles uh, catch up with all that work that I did. But it's, I'm not going to let it stop me, I'm not going to let it stop me. Today, I want to plant some cucumbers, so I'm going to get started on that. <laughs> I got three mounds made for the cucumbers. I'm gonna grow three different varieties of cucumbers. Uh, the first one is a straight eight, straight eight cucumber. Uh, these were gifted to me uh, from Tiny Hilltop, uh, their channel, and they've just started getting active again. So I'll put a link, uh, hopefully a card up there and a link down below to Tiny Hilltop. Send me a bunch of seeds um, a couple years ago, so I'm I'm happy to put them into use. But these are you know, straight eight cucumbers. Those are one of the more popular varieties. Next one I am planting are uh, Sumter. Sumter, the most popular pickling cucumber for pickles of all sizes. All right, all right, you sold me. And then the. Uh, the third one I'm going to do is Market More 76, one of our best slicing cucumbers, produces heavy early crops, sold. So uh, those are the three varieties of cucumbers I'm going to do here on this uh, trellis fence. And then uh, I made three mounds for them. And then in the last section, I'm going to grow some uh, bush peas. These are Green Arrow bush peas so they don't um, they don't get very tall but they still need a, a trellis to support them so I'm gonna do a little last little bit on these uh, these will be done you know this summer and so uh, that'll give me another crop I can get another crop in that section later this year probably I don't know I don't know uh, thanks again all of I'm not, I have not bought one seed packet this year and I'm well I want some four o'clocks, those are flowers. But other than that, I don't plan on buying any seeds this year uh, because you have gifted me all the seeds I can need. Um, man, I just, uh, I had lost some of them. Well, but I just found them. I was searching everywhere in my old room in the mobile home, uh, all the gifts that you sent me, a bunch of them from Uncle Hoss, and I knew there were tomatoes and peppers in there. Um, uh, I knew there were tomatoes and peppers in there, but I couldn't find them, so I was freaking out there for a little bit. But I had already put them in the, in the tiny cabin, so I found them. All's well in the world, except some four o'clocks, which, you know, I can live without some four o'clocks this year. Uh, I lived without them last year. Okay, now I'm going to plant the three mounds of cucumbers and the row of bush peas.
Those are the bottoms of the three incubators I just used. So I got them all scrubbed down and cleaned out. So incubators are cleaned up and ready to go. If I should decide to hatch some more in the near future, which I don't know yet. Three varieties of cucumbers planted into three uh, mounds. So straight eights, Sumter, and what was the last one? Market more, something like that. Very nice. So that entire fence uh, is planted. I measured it today. It's about 25 feet. So 25 feet of trellis there. And the last little six, seven foot section, I did bush peas. And those should be done this summer. So that will leave me time to grow something else there in that spot uh, later this fall. So yeah, not bad. I got the incubators cleaned out, you know, just in case. Um, not a bad day. Uh, you know, I wasn't feeling awesome today, so at least I got that done. And if I keep at it, I'm going to get all kinds of stuff planted here in the near future. Okay, that's it. Time for a nap. Got to catch up on the naps. Thanks for watching. Hope your spring is as lovely as mine is turning out to be. And take her easy, everybody. Oh yeah, thanks again for all the seeds you sent me over the past couple years. They are all coming in handy right now. So yes, thank you very much for the seeds. And I like the I like the you know the hand-me-downs, the people that saved their own and then uh, sent me some extras. So I'll be doing some of those coming up. So if you sent me some seeds that you would save from your own crops, be on the lookout. Thanks again. <laughs>